which I mean, look how good it is. <laughs>there. They're sturdy. These are so cool. I might be keeping one of those. <laughs> okay, so these are the basic ones. These are the special ones. So let's see the difference between these basic ones and these fancy ones. Wow. These are so cool. Wow. So much more detailed. A little heavier, like they use a little bit more wood in them. A lot more detail on the handle. Stunning. They're just, they're, these are absolutely gorgeous. Oh, these are so pretty. There aren't any sharp edges at all. Everything is just very smooth. So neat. Okay, so I'm going to put one of these like really fancy advanced ones next to one of their basic ones and then take up a little close up so that you can see the difference. Okay, that was the wands. Now let's see what's next. Oh, I'm excited about this already. These are rice bags. So the idea with these is that you microwave them and they turn nice and warm and you can use them if you have like period cramps or muscle cramps from working out and they are just nice and warm and comfy to hold against your body and relax those muscles. And these ones are all scented. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this one's so good. Sort of like a, like a lavender scent. It's very nice, very calming. Absolutely awesome. So we've got a Legend of Zelda one. Oh, this is cute. They're like little Disney emoji ones. And then this one just has a whole bunch of like superhero themed like sayings like pow, zonk, bang, oof. That one's so cute. Oh, these smell so good. And these really, really cute rice bags are only $3 a piece. I could totally see myself buying one of these as a gift for a friend and just finding like the fabric print that would really speak to them. These are cute, they're thoughtful, they don't take up a lot of space, they smell amazing, and I bet they feel really good too when you heat them up in the microwave. Very cool. Okay, diving into the box of wonder once more. Ooh, we're getting into the clothes. I'm so excited about this. So before I went full time as like a writer, a creator, or kind of running my own business thing, I was a drama teacher. So things like cloaks and all these beautiful crushed velvets just make me so happy and they remind me of like, you know, my, my previous life. <laughs> I'm so excited to get into these. So let's try them on and see what it looks like. Okay, so this is the blue crushed velvet cape. It is beyond floor length for me. So I would actually even need a M. So if you're really tall, I am 5'6". So if you're taller than that, this cape will absolutely still be floor length. It clasps right here in the front, so I'm gonna step forward a little bit so that you can see. It has like a metal clasp in the front and a hood. And it is so comfy and it sits just beautifully on the body. Like you get that whole dramatic flare when you open your arms. It feels light with just enough weight to give you that dramatic feel. You would swish it dramatically. This green one is exactly the same as the blue one. Same length, same fabric, same feel, just a different color. This really deep, rich green. Love it. Look at those swishing. 
has a hood, has that same sort of flowy lightness when you lift it, and the black one. You gotta love just a classic black cloak. I am completely and utterly disappearing in this because <laughs> I'm also wearing black. But again, same fabric, beautiful high quality crushed velvet, nice sturdy metal clasp, beautiful hood, great flowiness. It's more than floor length on me. I'm losing my breath because I'm so excited. This is so fun. I've always loved just wearing capes and just like marauding around the house. I am the Knight of Darkness. I've come to steal all your Copic markers. <laughs> I'm having too much fun. <laughs> and this is the lace cape. This is so pretty. I feel very like delicate and flowy in this one, like a fairy. <laughs> This one clasps with just a ribbon bow tie instead of a metal clasp, which also adds to that kind of more delicate, airy sort of feel. And just look how cool <laughs> that is. It is absolutely see-through. You can see exactly what you're wearing under it, which would be awesome if you wanted the drama of a cape, but you also didn't want it to cover your entire outfit or your really beautifully, carefully put together cosplay that would then be completely hidden in a regular cape. This one just allows you to have that still dramatic flair. Elsa, <laughs> and still be able to get the drama of the cape and not hide your outfit. I am beyond impressed with the quality of these items and just how much fun these are to wear. I'm having a blast. <laughs> oh, and this one also has a hood. And that was all of the cloaks, but we are not done yet because another one of the products I'm so excited to try are actually their skirts. She makes all sorts of just absolutely adorable skirts with this just the cutest, geekiest, nerdiest fabrics, and I'm excited to dive into them and try some on for you. So let me move these aside and I'll get those skirts up and we can take a look at them. I got six skirts to show you here and they are so cute, I can't even stand it. So let's start, we'll start from this direction and go across and I'll show you what they all are. So starting with this one, this one is like a red and black and white paneled skirt that is Batman. They look like Batman comics. And these are so cute, look at that. And they have little ties right here so that they're kind of customizably sized. So all that you have to do is just kind of wrap them around yourself and tie them. Look how cute that is. Oh my goodness. That's darling. Okay, next one we have over here is Star Wars. And this one has kind of a crinkly, glittery sort of belt on it. And then the fabric are different panels of Star Wars, Stormtroopers, and then just a nice, beautiful, deep blue. Now, these are wrap skirts, so they're the ones that you, like, wrap around your body and then tie. This one was big enough to go around my body twice, so I feel very secure. I don't feel like it's going to flap open and reveal anything. And look how cute it is. Because it layers twice, it gives that kind of A-line look that you want these skirts to have. I feel very cute. Totally would see myself wearing a skirt like this to like a Comic Con or Fan X. Right here we have Marvel superheroes. And this one, the belt is made out of the same fabric as the rest of the skirt is. Cute, big, loud. I could totally see people wearing these at like Fan X or Comic Con. This one is a Doctor Who TARDIS skirt. Fabric is actually, it's really nice. It's not like super soft, but it has really good structure. So like if you put it on, it would actually keep sort of like an A-line look on it. Very cute. Hogwarts houses. So she asked when she handed me these skirts, my house was, and I told her Gryffindor. So she sent me a Gryffindor skirt, which is so, so cute. Okay, here is the Gryffindor house skirt. Now this one was so big, it actually wrapped three times around my body, which gives it a lot of volume. And actually, I really like that effect. It's really pretty. It does feel a lot heavier than the other skirts because it's a lot more fabric. I definitely feel very secure. I ended up tying this one with the bow right here because I thought that was a really cute detail, but you could also tuck it in, spin it around so it's out of your back so people don't see that detail. They're really quite flexible skirts. You can do a lot of things with them. And how cute is this? This last one is the one I'm probably the most excited for. It is the Harry Potter Marauders map skirt. Now this one doesn't quite fit me. It goes a little over once around me, which doesn't allow me to get that really comfortable wrap on it. So I would definitely want to wear this one if I kept it with pants or shorts underneath it because it will just like 
flap right open. But it is so cute. This one is a slightly different fabric, so it hangs differently, and you can kind of see that it sort of swirls differently than the other skirts did. But very cute. Absolutely love this fabric. Would need a size up for my body type. Wow! <laughs> These are all of the products from Barrett Cloak and Wand. I have had so much fun testing and trying all these out, and I want to send a big thanks to my friend McKay who sent me all of these products that she and her husband have handmade everything here. Now, on to the next business. Hi, it's Elsie from the future. As I was editing this video, it turns out that this particular section of this video with this particular shop ended up being so much longer than all of the other products that I was testing that I decided to just have this be its own video and we'll do all of the other products in next week's video. So stay tuned to see the rest of the business's products that I'm going to be testing in next week's video. I'll put them all together in that one. See you next week.